ப்ராஜெக்ட் கோல் ஐடி ஐஓடி ஜீரோ செவன் ப்ராஜெக்ட் டைட்டில் ஐஓடி பேஸ்ட் கோல் மைன் சேஃப்டி மானிட்ரிங் அண்ட் கண்ட்ரோலிங் அப்ஸ்ட்ராக்ட் த மெயின் தீம் ஆஃப் த ப்ராஜெக்ட் ஸோ வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு டெவலப் ஏர் மைண்ட் சேஃப்டி சிஸ்டம் using automatic controller based system so we are going to develop a mind safety system using automatic controller based system so in real time scenario so what are the drawbacks we are facing so first one in real time scenario first one is no safety for coal mine workers so they are just wearing normal helmet material helmet so the, uh, there is no communication between the communication is less among the base station to coal mine safety coal location so next one then going to propose a system in a, in a proposed method so we are going to develop a arduino based safety system which is going to monitor the con- monitor the humans inside the coal mine area this is a proposed method we are going to implement so and then existing drawbacks so in the existing method what we are using is so first one is transmit of data is very less data is less and more difficult so this is the existing method we are, we are using and then drawbacks so first one is drawbacks of existing method is so difficult to monitor and then less security in case of any emergency the security assistance is very lesser this is the drawbacks in existing system in proposed system we are going to update the data update or upload the data yeah iot model wirelessly so advantages of the proposed method so faster data transmission so and then we are going to monitor all the time so this is the proposed block diagram here we are using one controller this arduino mega we are going to use so this is out of the uh, uh, proposed method here it having inputs of gas sensor fire sensor for temperature we are using tst11 for temperature and humidity and accelerometer for accelerometer so these are inputs and the uh, outputs come the, to the controller itself lcd display and then iot model 
and then zigbee and relay from relay we are using dc fan and motor so these are the components which are going to implement and then we are using power supply to power the system and this power supply we are using one 12 volt adapter system so once we give the power supply so arduino is coded with embedded c program here we are going to code a program which is going to monitor the all the sensor data here we are going to set the threshold level so if the threshold level is reached means it will send the data to the iot or to lcd etc this is a block diagram so this is the receiver section here the zigbee is uh, act as a receiver once the data from the base station or coal mine safety coal mine safety data is transmitted to via yeah, zigbee tx here the zigbee rx is receive the data and then the data is processed using arduino you know and then the data is displayed in lcd so this is the base station of the proposed method base station so arduino is powered by power supply external power supply of plus 5 volt dc this is a block diagram and then the components explanation so first one we are using arduino mega this is a controller name so ic which we are using is at mega 2560 and then supporting voltage is plus 5 volt dc so pin configurations having pins of 0 to 53 digital pins and a not to a15 analog pins here we are using uart protocol so this one universal asynchronous receiver and transmitter this is the protocol name here we are using 9600 bits as a baud rate we are using so next one the component we are using is dst11 sensor so dst11 supporting voltage is plus 5 volt dc so it can monitor first one is temperature second one is it can monitor humidity of the surrounding location so next one we are using lcd we are using 16 cross 2 lcd so 16 is a column and 2 is a row supporting voltage is plus 5 volt dc so next one we are using is geared motor here the gear motor is uh, act as a gate like that so we are using 12 volt gear motor rpm of 100 or 200 rpm so next one we are using dc fan here we are using dc fan of 12 volt fan operating voltage so next one is we are using adapter Sensor adapter we are using SMPS which converts 230 volt AC to 12 volt DC from the adapter by connecting to the Arduino Uno controller for power supply. So next one is Zigbee model. Here we are using Zigbee model. It either act as a receiver and transmitter, so it's working in the principle of UART protocol. So it needs 9600 bits per second of the baud rate. This one is a protocol. So next one, we are using IoT model for IoT. We are counting the Arduino from the Arduino controller. We are counting sensors 
So sensor data is read and processed from the process data. Arduino is connected to the IoT model. Here we are using ESP8266 model version 12E. So the data is here the IoT model receives the data using UART protocol. From the protocol, it's transmitting data received the data and is uploaded to the cloud server. Its uploading voltage is plus 5 volt DC. So next one is here using MEMS accelerometer. Its uploading voltage is plus 5 volt DC is going to uh, use for measurement measurement of angle it having x y and z angles so next one is used for, for direction of the human fall etc so next one is we are using higher sensor here we are using higher receiver model so opening voltage is plus 5 volt dc so this one is digital sensor So next one is here using gas sensor. Here we are using MQ2 for carbon monoxide or carbon dioxide and MQ13 is for air quality monitoring. Air quality monitoring. So next one is software requirements software we are going to use Arduino IDE and then the language we are using is embedded C so this is the software requirements and then application of the project so this type of application can be used in coal mine safety so next one smart home automation and then we can implement it in smart helmet etc so these are the application and real time examples we can implement this proposed method so and then file conclusion here, here we are going to develop a so Arduino based safety system for coal mine workers was implemented and this this improves the safety of the coal mine workers. Thank you.